Um, hey, uh, I just got second place today at Area 51 uh, here in Modesto. Uh, today I was playing Dinos, Mech Knight Invoked, Sky Strikers, uh, and then Goki, but not U Link Goki. And the last matchup of the day was against Hat Invoked. Uh, Trick stars uh, to ultimate <laughs> conductors. He is the big boy, very bitch. Uh, Book of Moons, pretty good in stopping link plays um, against like Goki and the like. And not a lot of people can get over it. Uh, Afterburners, no. Afterburners makes me sad. One Quatlas, uh, only one because he's a bit of a brick in hand. And you really, most of the time, you only use him as fought, as dumping fodder so he can get a double evolution build. Then we have one giant Rex. Uh, uh, sometimes I want to run the second one just so I have more things to go into with Miscellaneousaurus, but one's good with me. One Miscellaneousaurus because it's limited. Uh, feels bad, but he's pretty good. Protection, uh, recursion. Uh, triggering Giant Rex, all that's jazz. And then three over Raptor. Uh, Stratos and the Foolish Burial in one and does some reviving shenanigans. Uh, really good with Lost World Up. Two babies, only two because this isn't a true King variant and he's a bit of a brick in your hand. Uh, going first and yeah, he's a bit of a brick in your hand going first and if you have no way to get him off, uh, you really only like having him if you already have ulti conductor on the board or sending him off of a boss world yeah and then into the other stuff gamma package uh and the and the brick shiny brick um i i feel like he's the best hand trap because not only does he stop um your opponent's plays uh if you're going if you're going first or second and you have an empty field of if you like fossil dig and they um, drill you, it's pretty good because then you get a free omega and you don't get drilled. And then we have three ash. Uh, I feel like that's self-explanatory. Two Valor. Uh, this would be impermanence, but I don't have the money for that. And you know, sometimes you prefer Valor over impermanence because it also gives you fodder for evolution pill. And then we got Kaiju package. Uh, we hate Ulinx, and um, it's a pretty natural way to get into breaking the Ulinx because we have Dogger on here, searchable, and uh, gets rid of other problem monsters like uh, Ultimate Conductor and Sharia Beast. Then we have Port Wipes. Uh, I run these two and not Regeki because. It's used less for clearing the field and more so if I'm like stuck going first and if the only thing I have is like Lost World or a baby, either or, uh, it gets, it could get you going. Uh, after that, we got three Lost World, two Terraforming. Uh, even though Lost World's really good, but you don't want to see it that much, especially not in the multiples. So that's why um, I'm not running the full six field spells. After that, two evolution pill. Uh, three is too much, I feel. And sometimes you want to hard draw it. Uh, sometimes, but not all the time. One foolish burial. Uh, just send Quatlis or Giant Rex, whatever you need. Sometimes even something that doesn't do anything in the graveyard, like a like a Valor, just so you can get your. Um, just to get like double evolution pill sort of live. And then three fossil day is just a better rota. Uh, it gets your level six or lower dinos. Uh, I only run level four in lower, but you know, it's nice having that option for level six. Two twin twisters, because back row is a pain for this deck. Uh, things like Widow Anchor, uh, Anti Spell, those things. Three called by the graves because this is a OTK focus deck and hand traps are stinky. You don't want them in your face. And that's it for a main deck. 40 cards. 
Uh, no traps, because this is an OTK deck. Uh, should I go into the extra deck or side deck? Uh, okay. For extra deck, I got basic nightmare package for removal. Uh, I don't go into Cerebus too often, but you know, I'd rather have him there for the times I do need him, rather than just replace him with something else. I'm not sure what I'd replace him with. But these two come up often, just getting rid of back row, like banging out of scapegoat, and just general removal. Uh, for the other links, I forgot this part of the Nightmare Package, but whatever. Uh, Underclock, Ripper Duckus, and Mermaid. Mermaids just in case they give you an Ugly, and for some reason they don't extra link you. So it's like free uh, hello material, sort of. Because then you summon something like a Over Raptor or some Quatlus, and then link off into like one of these two. Uh, Underclock is really. is Underclock. Um, Helps facilitate the LGK uh, if you have Conductor up and they have a bunch of monsters up. Reproductus is mostly so I can play under one of my side deck cards, Rivalry. But um, every once in a while, he sort of comes up. I, I, it's a little hard to explain, but uh, no, it, it's really not. Um, if you have Reproductus and Reproductus under Rivalry, your opponent has something here and you could just change the type and then they have to be sent to the graveyard because it's a different type. Uh, so that's pretty neat, I guess. Uh, you can make summon sorcerers with it, but you don't really need sorcerers in this deck. Now, on to the Xyz. Pissed off Mox to end games when you have double Tyranno, and you just, so for some reason, haven't pushed enough damage. Uh, Evil Story package. Uh, I'm considering running one more of these guys, but eh, it's, I feel like I'm fine with it as it is. Uh, in case you don't know what it does, this is Solemn Judgment, and this is Strike two times. This is two strikes. One Baguska, because Guska Pass is for when you have a really poor hand, but you can still make a rank four. And you're going first, because going second just doesn't really do anything. Tornado Dragon for uh, back row, because again, back row stinky. Best Roller. Uh, for going against like, Goki or True Dracos. Cowboy because time sucks. Omega for Gamma. Uh, it has some synergy and like it doesn't come up often, but it has some synergy with like Miscellaneousaurus. You can send him back or you know things banished by uh, reincarnation or Cyclone, whatever. And finally, my Spice tech. Um, Fortress Dragon, a uh, Mega Fleet Dragon, not Fortress, uh, for outing in the Goki Extra Link. And uh, yeah, because I have Cyber Dragon in my side. It's a big boy. Uh, going into my side deck, hit me. Um, personal markers. And now to the actual side. Uh, two Rivalry of the Warlords. Uh, it's mostly for going first, but it could be good going second also because it could out yeah, big right. boards yeah. with multiple types, such as, you know, the Goki Link. But to out the Goki Link, you usually need something to bait out the uh, yeah. Trigate beforehand. And, you know, personally speaking, Gozen's better for outing the extra Link because it's mostly fiends, but, you know, it's still a good card. Really, um, really good if you have Lost World up and they, you gave them the token. Uh, three red reboot because back row sucks and uh, you know a random storm in here. If playing against things like stun or alter guys, it helps keep it at bay and whatnot. Uh, and you can also use it for evenly match, but I never really cite that for evenly match because I never feel like my opponent's gonna make me go first most of the time unless they're going second deck like uh, mech knights. Wait, no. Wait, wait, no, I got that backwards. Uh, even though they make me go first most of the time, I'm not really scared of even match for some reason. I don't know why, but... Yeah. One more Twin Twister for the really back row heavy decks. Two shared rights for going first against like the top decks, like uh, Sky Strikers. Because uh, it's maxi, basically. Three Ogres for decks that it's good against. Three Cyber Dragons um, for 
decks that really like the extra monster zone and Goki's off. Uh, uh, I used to main deck this, but when I realized that some decks would make me go first, it's kind of dead. Um, another fun thing about it is that it's also synergizes well with things like Pell because it gives you free link material uh, when you special summon it. Even if it, if you spec. Uh, if you have it in hand and they don't have anything in the extra monster zone, it's still fine because it's still free special summon and it's basically a link material you can go into with like over after after you've dumped uh, Quatlis. Uh, it's still, you know, it gets you a different type for the pill. Finally, one Quatlis for those matchups where uh, I feel like I'm better off going first and. Uh, and where I feel like this would be a better uh, option to go into with pills, such as uh, Sky Strikers, because uh, they don't really have a lot of things you could flip face down in the first place with Conductor. And uh, if you try to do it on Ray, they're just going to go into Gagari, and that's unless you have something like a Call of the Grave, that's sort of a waste. And you know, I feel like this is going better against them because it negates a lot of their spells. That's pretty much it. Uh, shout outs to the Chuckle Hut and uh, to Area 51 for hosting the tournament. Uh, shout outs to Hawaii, hometown, sort of. Uh, and that's pretty much it. Thank you for watching. Thanks, man.